first exercise we're going to look at is the push-up plank. Basically, it's a push-up position that you just hold. Something that I want to uh, talk about is something I also mentioned during the front plank video is the idea of having good sort of spinal mechanics both during your setup and then as you do the exercise. So what you want to think about, and if you have somebody at home that can check this for you, it's a great idea. Grab something, again, a stick, a br um, something like this, a dowel, a broomstick, uh, something that, you know, maybe three feet long or so. And what you want to have is contact with the back of your head in between your shoulder blades and down by your tailbone. And that should be maintained all the way through the exercise. So for the push-up plank, you're going to get into a push-up position. Again, hands are under the shoulders. Once I'm down, I'm gonna think about kind of screwing my hands into the ground to help stabilize and lock in my shoulders. One of the things that people tend to do is they let their head drift forward. So although it's not a good look uh, for most people, double chin, right? Kind of pack your neck in and tuck your chin in that way to keep your neck lined up with the rest of your spine. So I can actually do a bit of a modified position, like the modified plank. I can go into quadruped, hands and knees, and then move into my push-up position from there. So from here, I can actually set my neck, lock in my shoulders, and then walk back into my push-up position. From here, it's all about total body tension. Now when I'm done, I can come back to my quadruped position and the exercise or that set is done. But make sure, take the time to set those things up. And if you lose the head position, your set should end. Having you start one way and finish with your low back kind of caved in, your head forward, you know, that means you're doing it incorrectly. That means you should stop your set, not just power through with terrible technique. So really focus on how you do it, keep that total body tension, and then we'll see you for the next exercise.